and with each breath as you exhale, feel yourself getting heavier and heavier and more and more connected to the ground, connected to earth. Breathe naturally, don't control your breath, but observe and let go at each exhale. Concentrate on your body, scan it. Starting from the feet and follow the rhythm of the breath to scan step by step, step each part of your body, your feet, the toes, the two big toes. the little toes and if you feel tension at each exhale release the tension give it to earth your heels your calf muscles, release in the ground, your knees, see if you feel any tension and release it or them with your breath. your pelvic area all your legs and your tights your lower back your belly your back your spine give it to Mother Earth be one with it There's no you, there's no Mother Earth, there just is what is. Your shoulders, your chest, your arms your elbows all is one your wrist your hands feel all how all is one with earth feel your connection your fingers
your neck. your head your jaw your nose your eyes your forehead When you let go, when you want with me, all is peaceful. The rhythm of breath is the rhythm of life. Is it me? I am. I am the Divine Feminine Energy and I am here today to connect with you and to show you the way to your own peace and freedom to make you remember your true nature your true essence. It starts with the body. Feel this fluidity. Feel this love in your body right now. If you feel tensions, give them to love. Give them to me. By not holding onto them. Just let go. Your breath is your connection to me also. If you see yourself thinking a lot of thinking, go back to your breath and feel the love in the air that you inhale and in the air that you exhale. Feel all the air, how the air is abundant. How this life is given to you at each instant, always. Feel how it nourishes you. your body and your soul.
transmission of energies right now. In the silence, all is. I am Kuan Yin, divine femininity, healing hearts and souls. My essence is pure grace, purity, delicacy, infinity. I heal the hearts and I connect you to your purity, vulnerability and femininity in its pure crystal essence. Feel the warmth in your heart right now. To be feminine is to have this ability to hear even the subtle, subtle sounds. In yourself first and then outside. Feel this very subtle grace that defines you also. Like a flower, the fragrance of a flower in a field of grass. Many flowers, but one has its own smell, fragrance, and you need to go close to it to smell it. And when you put the flower close to you, to your nose, it 
Its fragrance is subtle yet powerful. This is femininity. Each one of you has their own fragrance that can be smelled from far and yet when you approach is more and more powerful and unique. A flower doesn't try to smell like the other flowers. Its unique unicity, singularity, makes it powerful and defines its flower essence and nature. I invite you to discover or rediscover what is your fragrance. Transmission of energies to help you find your fragrance now. You don't need to think, just be and feel. If emotions come to the surface, let them be. They are part of your fragrance. They are here and now. An aspect of yourself. Don't resist, surrender, it is only you that you're going to discover. And I am here with you to guide you.
You are blessed. You are beautiful. You are loved. If you need healing in your heart, tell me now, inside yourself, in silence, what you want to be healed of. Give me your pain, give me your frustration, give me your grieving. And feel how all that happened to you all the things that hurt your heart never really touch your true essence, your purity, your love. Nothing is damaged. Even if a footstep crashes, steps on a flower. It doesn't touch the essence of a flower. Realize this, my dear ones. The flower still is and will always be. Nothing, absolutely nothing can damage it. Let me heal your heart now. Let the pain be. This is part of a healing process. The pain is seen, the pain is felt, and I take it. pink light, a very soft pink, a pale pink, is coming from the sky, from the roof, and descending like a pillar on your chest right now. It's the energy of Kuan Yin. Feel this pearl pink going through you. Starting from the heart and this pillar is growing and growing, becoming bigger and bigger. A pillar of pink light, pure, soft, Nurturing. And feel yourself one with it now.
and see it absorbing all the darkness, the shadow, the clouds created by past experiences or present experiences of pain, disappointment, grief. It's a very gentle energy. Yet, gentleness and softness don't mean weakness. Let it surprise you. Just welcome it and be one with it. I am Kuan Yin, healers of hearts. Giving you hope in relationships. Showing you that everything is possible, absolutely everything. Continue to feel this gentle energy around you, inside you. This pearl pink. Being one with it. Purity. Open yourself. bright white light is descending on this room right now. I am Mary. another expression of a divine feminine energy. Okay. 
surrender to me. Open your arms. Welcome all my love for you. I heal your body, your soul. I'm like a bright sun in the summer. Feel my light. Nurture yourself with it. This is my gift today for you. Feel the power of this light and yet is purity, clarity. Innocence. All these words define you. Transmission of energy right now. Feed yourself like the flowers with the sun. Mm. Regenerate. All is temporary in life. Don't try to cling to anything or you will be unhappy at one stage. Grab the light. Grab the love from inside. That's all. I ask you and suggest you to do the only permanence in this world is love, the sun. Feed yourself with it. It's your essence. Everything, absolutely everything, will pass. But not your movement towards love. This will always be eternal. Because it is your essence. Do this and all will be open for you in life. All will be freed and clear. Feel my energy now.
Let me heal you. Rest in my arms. Rest, rest, rest. It is safe. It is always safe to rest in my arms. Love is pure, the truth is pure, love is simple, the truth is simple, that's how you know if you are in the right place. Feel this purity. Feel how simple all is right now. The sun shines, that's all. You just have to shine. You just have to be. Not what you're supposed to be. Not what you would like to be. Let's just be present here and now in your own unique way of being. That's all. Follow your intuition, intuition from the heart. The truth is simple. The truth is joyful. Where there is joy, there is light, there is love. That these, these are the keys. That's all. No need to plan, no need to think. Just follow your first movement your first intuition that brings you joy, 
that is light and that is light and simple. See and know that the truth is very simple, too simple for the mind. That's why we always try to complicate things. We always think that the more it's complicated, the more it has sense. But I tell you, my children, a flower is very simple in its essence. It just rises, looks for the sun, opens with the sun, and it closes at night. It offers its fragrance to humanity, to nature, to the all, the whole. It has no intention. It just is a flower. And you call it a flower but he doesn't even know that it's a flower. It is just, it is. I ask you, my dear children, my dear ones, to do the same. Just express who you are, where your heart brings you. You want to sing, sing. You want to rest, rest. You want to be sad, be sad. Let all things be. And you will see, life will open to you. The universe will respond to you very, very quickly. Even if you express sadness, as you call it sadness. Feel the simplicity of all things. Be wild, be free. Life is short. At least the expression of yourself on this planet. Because you are eternal. You are grace, purity, delicacy, subtlety, expressed, incarnated. You are crystal, incarnated in this body made of earth. Earth is like you. It is an expression in the matter of an essence like you. Just 
transmissions of energy right now. The energy of Mary is coming upon you, a bright white light from the sky going in your body towards the earth. And the energy of Mother Earth is also coming to you from the center of the earth going up all the layers towards this room and into your body right now. Both energies are meeting, melting in your body right now. Feel how you are taking care of release all that you have to release now. Both energies melt in your heart. From the heart, they grow, and the heart energy grows from the heart to all your body, to all the room, to planet Earth, and to heaven. Feeling of your emotional body. Of your physical body. Releasing of a past and of all that doesn't serve you anymore. Clearing
I am Mary Magdalene and I am here to finish the work today on you. You are a flower, you are crystal, you have a fragrance, but it can express itself only if it is grounded deep into in the earth. This is, I am, another aspect of a divine feminine energy which rises from Gaia, Mother Earth, but expresses itself on the surface like the magma of a volcano. A crystal need the magma to be. You need this transformation. You need to take your power from the ground, for your, from your incarnation here and now, in this body, to express your love and your purity. It needs to come from down, gravity, and to raise up, rise up to heaven. Feel this power in yourself right now. Transmission of my energies. Don't be afraid of his power. Accept it in yourself. Give me your problems, your blockage your blocks and hear or see or feel my answers now. I am the fire in your belly. The fire that gives you strength and the energy to stand straight for your rights. Your rights as a soul, as a heart, as love. That's all I'm talking about. your verticality. Justice. Love. to express the fragrance of the flower, of your flower, of your essence. You need the strength, this energy that brings you out of the ground.
the soil and that makes you rise up. Never underestimate yourself. Never underestimate the power of love, of your love. Transmission right now. A very red energy. A dark red, intense red. Almost a dark pink. Goes into the room right now. And we can regenerate in it and take what we need from it now. It's a healing energy too. the energy of fire. Nurture yourself, my dear ones. This is the end of this transmission. If you have any question, to one of the aspects of the Divine Feminine Energy, you can ask now. Can I ask a question? Yes. I have a friend who's very ill, she's very ill, and she's very negative and angry, and I don't know how to help her. Is there anything I can do? Okay. This is Mary who is coming immediately. Don't believe in her anger. That's how you can help her. Don't believe also in her illness. Even if you see her ill, you know she's not at another level. Like Jesus would see, look at everyone equality with equality seeing only the true essence and love, like I would look at all of you and I look at all of you this way, I invite you to see her, see her essence. You need strength, you need faith, I know it. You have to pray and ask to see with my eyes every time you have interaction with her. Yes. If she's healed, ill, she chose it, you know it. Yes. Forgive her. Forgive her. This is where your pain is. Forgive her for choosing this path. Thank you. She is blessed and she is not alone. Your journey, your challenge, your exercise is to go through your own pain that is created by her experience. Forgive yourself too. Thank you. Thank you.
show her the light by not believing in her illness inside yourself of course not with words show her her light may she see her beauty in your eyes and it will help her in this tough experience thank you Yes. Um, could I ask for guidance and some kind of illumination around um, the fatigue that I've been feeling? Can you be more specific regarding elimination of the fatigue? Would you like to get rid of the fatigue? Yes. I've been diagnosed as having chronic fatigue syndrome. I don't know if that really is the case, but my energy levels go up and down and I get quite exhausted when I exert myself. Is there a reason for this? Can I have guidance to, to get well? Please, thank you. So it's Mary Magdalene. What are you avoiding to see? What are you tired of? It seems you are not completely fully living what you want to live deeply in your heart. You've been avoiding things, compromising. This is a first level of answer. I also can tell you to free you, that if you can see that you are up and down, you are not up and down, you are witnessing it. So two challenges in your experience is to inquire in yourself, what are you avoiding? What have you been avoiding for years and now your body is reacting as an expression of your soul. Second, go back to your true essence. So the answer to your question, you are not tired. Yet, something is tired in you. Don't be afraid to inquire in yourself. You've been limiting yourself, blocking yourself. What are you afraid of? Does it talk to you? Does it talk to you? Oh, I, don't, I don't know how to answer the question. I don't understand the question. Does what I say seems... Oh, uh, yes, it, in parts. I think I need to think more now. But in certain parts, it, it does make sense, thank you. What I feel is that you need to feel more than to think. It's like there are things you refuse to feel. Does it make sense? Um, we have to think about that. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not aware that I'm refusing. <laughs> Let's see. Mm. 
<laughs> you are not completely expressing who you are. You are restraining yourself. You are playing small. Yes, that's true. Stop this. This is my advice. I know the channeler is frightened by me because I'm very straightforward. But I know your soul can hear me and your heart. Be yourself. Truly, completely. Stop playing the game of pleasing around you and not wanting to be too much. Give yourself permission to completely be yourself. Have fun. Try. Be afraid, but try it and see. Are you, will you still be tired? Of course, there is a diagnosis, but you know. <laughs> Have fun, at least when you're up. And when you're down, inquire. Thank you. Thank you. You need to ground. It's going to help you a lot. <clears throat> Connect to Earth. Go back to the sensation of being in your body. With this will give you strength and this will give you the movement to really express what you want to be and live in this life. The elements are your friends. Nature is your friend. You have huge connection with nature if you allow it to connect with you. The elements will help you. Ask them and you will receive. Thank you. And Mary Magdalene, as I am, can guide you. Thank you. Thank you. I can take one last question. Purification of the energies. The pearl pink is organ in the room. I can breathe it. And as we exhale, exhale some things that we still don't want in us, if they're still things. Give it to this light. And gently, this light is fading. The light of Mary, this bright white light, is in the room right now. Last breath with Mary. And she's leaving slowly, but she stays, she's still here with us. And we can come back to our body by moving our fingers, our ankles, stretching and thanking Gaia, Mother Earth, for giving us birth. 
and gently coming back here. Thank you. Thank <laughs> you. 